Hi, I'm Lisa Nelson, beauty maven and celebrity makeup artist, and today I'm talking about how to cover a nose piercing. So if you had a piercing in your nose and you didn't want your employer to see it, or you felt for some reason that you needed to have it covered, maybe it's part of your dress code for work, or you do something specifically at work that requires you to not have it, there's a few things that you can do. So what you can do is just go ahead and put on your regular foundation. Go ahead and put on powder too. What we've done on this beautiful model, Haley Spung, is put on just a regular typical day look for her. So pretty earth tones on the eyes. Go ahead and shut your eyes for a minute. Just pretty colors here, nothing too drastic. Brown as the liner on top and a little bit underneath. We did fill in her brows a little bit and then just put a pretty nude lip gloss on her lip. In regards to the piercing, we're gonna go ahead and use a highly concentrated concealer, the little concealing brush. We're just gonna go right over the piercing hole. What you wanna do is just keep working the product into this area until you can get enough on to give you the coverage that you need. You can always blend with a fingertip or a sponge around the area so that it blends in with the skin in the surrounding area and it doesn't give you, you know, you don't want like a strong, you want it to blend in and look natural. You can actually sort of fill in in that hole. One thing too to mention is if you had some redness or some discoloration through here, they do make, for example, mint or green concealers that you could put down first and because green is the color opposite of red, it would minimize the redness in that area. And in that case, you just wanna go on top of that with a highly concentrated concealer. You can just see that we're filling that in so that there's less dimension and it looks flat. Blend the outer edges. And then another important part is just to make sure that you powder on top. In this case, we're just using a translucent powder. You want to just kind of pat and press that powder into that area because you're really just setting and going over the top of what you've just done. You just want to assess that it looks natural and blend out any edges there. Okay, great. So I'm Lisa Nelson, and that's how I would advise to cover a nose piercing.